Hey everybody, I'm David with Bolivar Live with Dan Priest. And Charlie. And Charlie the dog. <laughs> uh, it's been a while since we've been out here on the beach front, isn't it? Feels good. Uh, but it's going to be 85 degrees today. We're coming into Memorial Day weekend. Mm -hmm. It's about that time. It sure is. I, Dan pulled up out here and I said, what are we going to talk about? He said, hurricane season. I said, well, it's about that time. June 1st, isn't it? Yeah, June 1st. So we've been talking about checking your insurance all winter, you know, having someone go over it, whether it's theirs or they call you. What should people be doing now? Hopefully we don't need it, but like we always right. say, it's not a matter of if you're going to need it, it's when. What should everyone do now to get ready? Well, it is a good time to start addressing that. And, you know, it's a beautiful day back here today, but starting in June 1st, that can change in 48 hours and you better be ready to go. We've seen it. Yeah, we've, we've lived it, <laughs> we've seen been it. it. Yeah, we sure it. have. So, you know, now is the time to truly start getting ready. And the first thing that people don't really think about in, in getting ready is thinking about an evacuation plan, where you're going to go. So if you live on the upper Texas coast, anywhere, even if you're as far as Beaumont or Houston, you have to be thinking about leaving. Because it's not just you. It's a million and a half other people too. It's you, your family, your pets, a million and a half other people trying to get on a road to get out of town. You know, it's funny you say that because when Laura was coming in a couple years ago, you know, I stay on top of the things we were doing shows about it. And I told Chris, I said, look, we're gonna get up at 2.30, you're gonna catch the 3.30 a.m. ferry, <laughs> and you're gonna be in Austin by nine o'clock. Mm -hmm and you'll miss the traffic in Houston and miss the traffic in Austin. She thought I was crazy, but we've already got our box together with our papers and everything. But she had traffic when she was going through Houston and it wasn't traffic coming this way towards downtown. It was people jumping the gun and leaving because they didn't know what they were gonna do. You know, that's, that's an interesting, interesting thing you bring up. Um, leaving, being, knowing where you're going to go, and you probably should have two different directions, one to the west, maybe to the north and to the east, where you plan to go, if that's friends or just a town you want to visit to get out of the way. But leave early. Don't wait. Because if you, if you wait, you're mm -hmm. with everybody else that waited. Make an early decision, and if, you, if you're wrong, you had a nice day out of town overnight. And if you're right, then you beat the trap and you don't have to spend up to 24 hours on the road, which happened before. So getting that plan together and getting it ready is, is, the, first is the first step. Secondly, you know, get some supplies because even if you go out of town and you're good, you're going to want to come back in and check on your property. And when you come back in to check on your property, you may find, as we experienced before uh, in Lumberton here, you could be out of power for two weeks, three weeks. You don't have uh, any refrigeration for your food. So get perishables together. There is a list on FEMA of things that you need to do, but make sure you have three or four days of food and maybe five days of water to start, to come back into town, to check on your property, to be there if you want to stay and, and, and move forward with that. You also need to make sure your insurance is up to date. That's what we do. Call us, call your agent, go over it. If you've done that recently, get copies of, of, of your, um, Policy. Of, your, of your policies and get phone numbers, get a communication plan, ask your agent what's gonna happen in the event of a storm and you need them. Uh, we, have a, we have a way that we're gonna be in, online the next day uh, if you need to, and I'm sure other agencies do as well. Check that out, find out how you're gonna need to contact them. Make sure you have the claims numbers in the event you cannot contact your agent. You know, it's in a disaster, that's what it is, it's a disaster and communication sometimes go down. My hurricane is about six cases of water in the back of my truck. And I keep that at the house from about the middle of June, 1st of July through until October. Yeah. And then we go ahead and use it. I keep it inside where it's cool, where it's not out in the sun. Um, I keep plenty of blood pressure medicine in the summer. Medications. Uh, now, last summer I had insulin um, that I was, I'm was i on. Uh, luckily I don't have to have as much now, but I always have, everyone laugh because I had about six cans of Spam and a loaf of bread when I left. 
and everyone said, what are you going to do with that? I said, trust me, I can have it raw or I can fry it and you can survive. And that's the biggest thing is plan ahead. And if you're not going to be traveling with a loved one, like Chris, I knew exactly where she was going all yeah. the way up to my mom's. Uh, you can get trackers for phones, you know, so you can find out if they, they're in trouble where they're at. But that's the biggest thing is we're coming up to the season and you want to be prepared. You know, I'm set up to where I'm mobile. I know your office is now mobile. We are mobile. To where they could be scattered everywhere, um, but they're taking care of customers. And it's the same way with me. If the cameras are down, we'll be back down here, you know, with coverage and stuff. But the biggest thing is prepare now, because let me tell you, there's nothing worse than last minute, oh, I need some batteries for the flashlight. I need to get bottled water. And let me tell you around here, it'll sell out quick too. Uh, that's the case anywhere that in the hurricane zone, which I, I consider Sam's clear yeah, out in one day. That's the at least the first two counties in off the coast is the hurricane zone and everybody, everybody's going to sell out. Please do not wait to the last minute or think it's not going to hit here because it, it might not. But if it does, you can't, you've got to be able to self-sustain. Don't forget your pet food either. Yeah. Uh, we went to my mom's for her 90th birthday three weeks ago and we got up there and everything and had the bowls and I told Chris, where's the dog food? So it, I had to make a mad dash. Was the dog the eating your spam? No, I had to make a mad dash down to the pet store to get her dog food because I I had it out. I just forgot it. But, you know, I carry gas with me. Like with Laura, mm -hmm. I had uh, 15 gallons in the back of the truck <laughs> just in case, you know, we had trouble getting gas and stuff so I could get around. So biggest thing is prepare now. Start putting a little bit together each paycheck and it really doesn't cost that much. Uh, yeah. Go over your insurance and a lot of stuff saves, you yeah. know, and have that box of your insurance, emergency phone numbers, uh, insurance policies, uh, water bill and your utility bill for down where you live because so you can get back in good if point. you have yeah. to. Um, all that stuff needs to be in one box just stays in there, run copies of it so that you have it year round. Cause with the freeze, you never know that. You never know. You never know. So, well, Dan, if people have questions on their insurance, how can they get hold of you? Give us a call, uh, 409-755-7600 or priestinsuranceagency.com to reach us yeah. that way as well. And you can call them, you can email them, uh, all that off their website. It's real easy to use. So, well, Dan, thanks for joining Thank us. Thank you. Glad we're out here on the beach. Charlie, is his name Charlie? Charlie. Charlie, hope you had a good time down here. Until next time, I'm David with Bolivar Live. Remember, you can see Bolivar Live now on Roku TV and Amazon Fire on Bolivar Live TV and now on our website. You don't have to have social media and you can stay connected. Until next time, God bless and bye-bye. Priest Insurance Agency has been located in the heart of Lumberton, Texas since 2001, providing a consultative approach and educating customers on how their insurance works for them throughout the coastal region of Texas. Priest Insurance specializes in the coastal region of Texas covering home, auto, business, and recreational insurance. With ties to the co coastal communities, Dan Priest has had the sand between his toes since 1972 with a home on Bolivar Peninsula in Galveston County. He survived a storm named Ike, but lost his home with insurance coverage, his family was able to rebuild following the 2008 storm and continues to make memories beachfront. Priest Insurance specializes in the coastal communities, family dwellings, investment property, and business insurance. They've been there. Whether you're looking for or have a family retreat along the Texas coast, investment property, or a business, Priest of the Insurance would be honored to work with you and your family to make sure you're covered anytime trouble arises. For more information on Priest Insurance and their contact information, please visit their website at www.priestinsuranceagency.com or their office is open for phone calls with questions and consultation Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 5.30 p.m., by calling 409-755-7600.
Priest Insurance Agency, working and educating customers, making sure they understand and have the coverage they deserve.